did very great work right from the beginning missionary was given these prayers and he truly took care of it every Thursday people come to be prayed for with various problems he was given a very great work praying for people Whoever has a problem with him, whoever has a problem with him, he is praying. God who saved me, you can also save the rest. We never knew where God was. Those prayers that he prayed for people every Thursday, where I was working, it got to a point I felt I've rejected the world. But there's no one to testify to me. Amen. I desire a Christian to say, my brother, Jesus saves. 
I don't get anyone. But in me I'm hungry. To forsake the world. Bwana Yesu asiwe sana. Amen. Kumbe ilikuwa ni maombi ya naomba hapo. Yet these are the pairs who are connected. Bwana okoa watu. Lord save people. Okoa watu ma. Save people Lord. Roho zinapotea. The souls are perishing. Bwana Yesu asiwe sana. Amen. Maombi hayo. Those prayers yalitufikia huko tuliko. Reach us wherever we are. Nikashika nimechoka. I felt I'm tired. Nataka kuokoka. I want to be saved. Lakini mtu hakunishuhudia sijamfata. One to evangelist to me is not there. Na ninaona aibu kwenda kanisani mimi. I'm ashamed of going to church. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lakini siku ilifika. But a day came. Mungu akaokoa mtu ambaye tunafanya na yeye. God said when I was working with. Ndio hilo neno nami likanifikia. That's when the word reached me too. Na ikawa ndio njia yangu. And that was my hunger. Nikaingia. I got in. Kuonyesha ilikuwa nimechoka wakati huo. Showing I was tired at that time. Sijapata na wazo. No thought came to me. Tangu wakati huo. From that time, na kufikiria to think maybe kurudi nyuma. Maybe to backslide. Sijasikia wazo hilo mwanangu. I've never heard such a thought in my heart. Bwana Yesu asiwe sana. Amen. Sijasikia hilo wazo. I've never heard that thought in my heart. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Naona kila kukicha. I feel every time it dawns. Sijapendeza Mungu vile natakana. I've not pleased God as I ought to please him. Naona kila kukicha. When it, whenever it dawns. Sijapendeza Mungu vile natakana. I feel I haven't pleased God as I ought to please Bwana Yesu asiwe sana. Amen. Kwa hivyo mimi nafurahi. So I'm so happy. Kwa mbele ya mtumishi wa Mungu. When I'm this, before the servant of God. Nyuma yake. Behind him. Yeye akisimama hapa. When he stands here. Basi mimi nasikia furaha kwa So kuleda. I feel so glad in me. Maana najua yale aninayo. Because I know whatever is ministering. Ni ya kuniokoa mimi. I'm meant to save me. Bwana Yesu asubiri sana. Amen. Ni ya kuniponya. They are meant to heal me. Haleluya. Haleluya. Huwa nasikia furaha sana. I normally feel so happy. Anaposimama hapa. Whenever he stands here. Aanze kuongea. Then he starts speaking. Maneno hayo najua yanatoka kwa Mungu. I know the words come from God. Basi mimi naona wivu. So I'm so jealous in him. hapa. Whenever I stand here. Huwa sitaki kuchelewa sana kusema. I don't wish to delay him. Kwa sababu because yeye ndiye ametiwa hilo neno. He's the one given the word. Yeye ndiye anatakiwa anene sana. He's the one who ought to speak much. Bwana Yesu asiwe sana. Amen. Ndio nikishimama whenever I stand nafanya muda mfupi I only work briefly and give him a chance ili yale maneno so that the word yasiwe na kizuizi should not have the hindrance ni siku ya maombi these are different intercession Mungu kabla hatujaenda kuomba before we go for prayers anayo maneno amempa he has the word from god to speak to us ndipo atoelekeze kwa maombi that's when he'll guide us for prayers Bwana Yesu asiwe sana amen kwa hivyo karibu mtumishi so, wa Mungu welcome the servant of god uja unene na sisi come and talk to us tuongoze and guide us kwa maombi ya jioni ya leo upon the prayers of this evening tuambie tell us Mungu anataka nini kwetu what god wants from us karibu sana mama welcome so much karibu sana welcome karibu sana Bwana Yesu asiwe sana. Amen. Ndio nishukrani kubwa kwa Mungu wetu wa mwanzilishi. It's great gratitude to our God of the founder. Kwa vile ambavyo ametulinda tangu jana. The way I secured right from yesterday. Tulinda usiku wote kuna yeah. utulivu. He has secured the whole night the tranquility. Sikiliza pembe zote za nchi yetu. Listening to all the news all over the country kidogo kidogo some areas lakini kuna amani huko na kule na kule but there's peace all over kiamini ya kwamba believing that Mungu ambaye ameanza kazi hiyo God who started that work kila sikio limetega ule mwisho all the ears paying attention to the end tunaamini ya kwamba and we believe that Mungu wa mwanzilishi God of the founder Yeye alianza kutupa amani. He must started giving us peace na utulivu and the tranquility. Natimiza na tatimiza. Will fulfill. Sababu tuliomba because we paid. Nimebaki kushukuru. What we need now is to thank him. Maana kinasema chuo ombeni. The Bible says pray. Pamoja na kushukuru. Together with thanksgiving. Aja zenu ajue Bwana. Your request to be known to the Lord. Ajazeni ajue bwana. Your request to be known to the Lord. Muombe pamoja na kushukuru. You pray together with thanksgiving. Ajazeni ajue bwana. Your request to be known unto the Lord. Ajazeni ajue bwana. Your request to be known to the Lord. Muombe sasa lazima tu mpiga magoti. Bring you don't all to nail down. Wala chakula huku unaomba hivi. Sometimes you are eating but praying down in your heart. Niokoe na lile. Save me from this. Kwa ndugu yule. Save that brother. Hata watembea. You are walking on the way. Sasa kwa unaomba. You may be praying in you. 
are speaking to one. And again you are praying in your heart. You are looking at him this way. Listening but you are praying in your heart. God hears. So long as down in your heart. God hears. You are traveling in a vehicle. You don't need to close your eyes. God hears the heart to find my being whenever you pray. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There are places you don't need to close your eyes. You are praying, opening up your eyes. But all the mind is in your heart. You don't see whoever is next to you, those people are standing next to you. Because all the mind is in the heart. And God hears us prayers. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's why you don't forsake coming together. Because the prayers are the only way to change our needs to God. First of all, you thank Him. Then very great gratitudes for the tranquility and peace. We believe our God who started the work God of the founder will fulfill. He'll accomplish. And by faith he has accomplished. Hallelujah. Because what God is under the sun is peace. That's what we learned from the other day. God is looking at somebody's heart. What do you want? What do you have with you? What thoughts do you have? What mind do you have? You want to be safe from where? What is your hunger? What is present in your heart? What do you have in your heart? What do you have? What desire do you have? Gani? What mind do you have? That's what God is saying in the life of my being. And God fulfills to one his hard desire. So you should be desiring in your heart first. At least God to see you. You are hungry him to take you out of this evil. Truly an evil. You're insane. But the desire for him to save you, at least to see you desiring in your heart. You are hungry to get out of evil. You have the repentance to get out of evil. Hallelujah. You will to be created in a godly way. Because we can't create ourselves. Whoever creates the Lord Jesus. Because the Bible says, He never came to save the righteous. But he came to save the sinners. He came to save people from their sins. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He never came to save the righteous, but the sinners. And again, he came to save people, his own people from their sins. Those who believe in him. And those whom in their heart they want to reform. They have the repentance to reform. Truly, Lies as depressed and surrounding you. But for Jesus to save you, he has to see you getting to a point. For how long will I be in this stage? For how long will I be in this manner? You are hungry to reform. Then to see you believing God, you are not able to reform yourself. He is the one with the power to reform you. Even if you will, you can't reform yourself. Even if you want to be safe from evil, but you can't save yourself. You need to will, then you believe the Lord Jesus can enable you. We read saying, you can't do anything without me. You will, you love, but you, know, you should know that you're not able to your capacity. Jesus, save me. Hallelujah. But first of all, you, you will in your heart. You should have that mind in your heart. Be enable that mind in your heart. Go to see you willing. You don't have the capacity to do good, but you are hungry, should God strengthen you. To see you, you are hungry to do good. He'll open the way. You see, whatever you are lacking, you are given now. Because he gives people their hard desires. But you say, how will I manage this? Those who are rich are there. 
Those who are blessed are there. How will I manage this? You don't will. Even those who see being saved, they never save themselves. One who saves is the Lord Jesus. He says, whoever will let him come, be will. Because he says, whosoever wills, those have overcome, they never overcame for themselves. They are called conquerors. Whoever conquered for them is the Lord Jesus. First of all, they will. Then they knew we are not able to own. They believe Jesus the power. Then they pray to him. Save me from lies. Cleanse me from this sin. Make a way for me for this service. At least try to, to do something good to somebody. They never save themselves. But first of all, in your heart, do you will. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do you will. Do you will. One who will, let him come. I said, for how long will I be mama? I came from our place to come here and mama. God help me. I will, but I'm not able. As I went to the elders, one day, I follow the servant of God, the late man, I see you to be having pain. You don't argue. When you are rectified this way, you forsake that way. I don't see offending anyone. How did you manage all this? Why in my soul? I'm full of scrutinizing. When I'm preached, I see my sin. I have a spirit that doesn't agree. I'm seeking whoever shared to the preacher. In my heart, I'm seeking. I'll agree later. For I to go to counseling. But what comes first? I've been warned. A preacher has touched my weakness. I feel like I've parted with him. Though, later I'll regret why I've opposed it. I go and call a preacher for counseling. Whatever the man of God preached is truly exactly how I am. But what came first when he touched my weakness, I feel I've parted with him. I feel like I'm wronged. I don't have the spirit of Accepting to be reproved. So I accept I'm a bastard. Because the Bible says, if you are not reproved, which is a portion to all, then you are the bastard children. You are not legitimate children. When you are reproved, you spring a feeling wrong. You feel your honor has been broken down. So I felt I'm a bastard child. Why don't I want to be reproved? Did I come here to argue with the men of God? That's why I told him. It is right from your father. If you are never reproved from your home, you hated your parents' warnings. So you two here, how will you be warned? And the foundation of a child the foundation of anyone, it depends on how we grew up from the past. They told me to go back and amend the beginning. That is a storm. In the midst of my salvation, I could not be merciful. At least being sympathetic to one. He has a problem. So I was totally not sympathetic in my soul. I was surprised I to what spirit is in me. Because for Jesus to save, he has to see you feeling the spirit I was here but not sympathetic to her. He has stumbled, maybe bleeding, but I don't feel sorry to him. People say, sorry, sorry. Maybe one has got a problem. People tell him, sorry. I'm totally not sympathetic to any. Being sorry to the weak. Being sorry to one with a trouble. They are not present in me totally. I was surprised too. I consider which spirit is this? How will I preach to people 
I'm truly sent by missionary. But I ask myself, I don't cry with those who cry. One has got a misery. I don't, I don't feel. Being sorry, so being sorry to one, I'm not. I said, I don't have the spirit of sorrow. This spirit here. Because for one to be saved, it's until you're able to decree for You feel truly my state is very wrong. I am a transgressor. I knew no. I have a spirit that doesn't save. First of all, the murmuring. When I said I never came here to mama. That's when you told me, go back to your home. Even today, you are not reproved. That's when I was shown my father. If you murmured your father, even before your friends, you, you speak in a narrative, for instance, any old man, to do this and this way, this way. This way. such a person, what do you do to I him? Say, they say, that's why you hear people hit by their children, children. Or maybe no, the neighbor, no. such a person, yeah. who is that? I tell that's an old man. Okay. But I'm targeting my father. One who mamas before against the parents to other people. I know this is a force of a curse. I will, but I'm not able. But first of all, what said me, I will. I want to reform. God enabled me to decree. Quit spirit in me this. That gives me not agreeing to be reproved. I was taken back to my father and my mother. When you wrecked from your father, so that way, could I even receive his warnings? And he used to go to the village and come at nine, nine or ten. And he loved me because we were born so many boy children, but we are only remaining two. He really loved us. Some are ladies. Where are you, my children? We are sleepy, you wake us up. Come here. She sit us down, there's darkness. There's nothing like electricity outside. I ask you to be good children. I feel I'm fed up with him. I'm feeling like I'm, like I'm starving. What time will you wind up his staff? Because I feel he ought to reform first. He's warning us. He should be the one to rectify this and this first. As I knew that. So the spirit in me that doesn't agree to be reproved that doesn't Consider child, it is right for my parents. I never agreed to be reproved. Because I hear too, I'm arguing. Hallelujah. God enabled me the repentance to feel I'm a sinner. When I repented, in my heart first I concurred. I've considered. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I feel that spirit going away. I got to a point. I desire a preacher to rectify me in this area and this area. Amen. Amen. That's the one day you are seated this way. The pastor of the Lord said this one has become a devil. Let him go his way and do his cares. We took him to school at least to benefit the church. Let me go away. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But because in my heart, repentance was created here. God strengthened me and enabled me. On Thursday, I followed him in the office. Where should I go? I said it's enough for the world. 
kama ni kazi za pesa nimesema ni basi big employment i was tired kwa za baba nimekwaza wajomba nimekwaza watu wa kwetu friended my father my uncles my relatives mimi ndi mtakuwa wokovu kwao they thought maybe i'll be a relief to maana katika mji wetu hakuna aliyesoma kufikia kufikia mimi in our village the stone was educated like me haya nikasema mimi kazi zote ni basi so i said i don't want to be employed hapa napo niwe hasara zero na to i end in vain basi nilikuwa nikalia machozi so i used to shed tears Haleluya. Haleluya. Machozi ya mimi nitaenda wapi? Tears feeling where will I go? Huo kovu nao ni, ni ukose na. salvation too I lack it. Haleluya. Haleluya. Nilisema na acha vyote. I said I'm forsaking all. Kwa Mungu nako niwe mshindani nikose kuokoa. To go to I argue and miss the salvation. Ndio Mungu akanisaidia. Doesn't God help me? Maana moyo nimetaka. Because I've well in my heart. Yesu anaweza badilisha mtu. Jesus can change one. Lakini Mungu wa, Mungu akuone kwanza una ile njaa unakula. Go to see you willing and hungry. Uwezo wa kutuokoa una Bwana Yesu. The power to save us is with the Lord Jesus. Hakuna dhambi haiwezi kutakasa. There's no sin Jesus can't cleanse. Yeye kama mwendea pale. Sasa I went to him in office. Na mwendea kule moyo nikiwa nimejaliwa toba. I'm going filled with repentance. Ka gonga mlango. I knock the door. Karibu ndugu. He said welcome brother. Eh ndugu karibu. Okay welcome. Na mwambia mimi kweli nimekuwa shetani. I tell him truly I become a devil kwa kazi hizi in this works. Mimi naomba uchague mistari atakaye mdogo. I ask you to choose one common. Mimi nitakuwa nyuma yake. Even if as a young child I walk behind him. Na naongea hivyo kutoka moyoni. I'm speaking that way down from my heart. Maana sizifanye hizi kazi kwa kawaida. Because I don't do this work. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Nazifanya kwa shukrani Mungu aje niponye asima to be. I work thanking God who will be from two across. Kazi yote nzito. I could not work manually. Sasa kama nitazifanya huku nimekuwa kikwazo kwa wao waombaji. I'll be doing this work of failing the kuniombea. That one who is perfectly haridiki. For I to be blessed it doesn't haridiki kila saa. Is not contented every time. Rimba rimba rimba. Basi mimi nikasikia kulia machozi. So I feel like shedding tears. Nitafaidika na nini? How will I benefit myself now? Ni yeye niwe nyuma ya wengine. Better you work behind the rest. Lakini nao wakiombewa nami niko hapo. But them too whenever they are prayed I'm also among them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Akanembea sivyo ndugu. He told me that's not the case brother. Sivyo? That's not the case. Mimi nataka mchonyi aokoke. I want the chonyi character to get out of you. Hapa ndani yako mimi nataka mchonyi aokoke. In you I want the chonyi man to be saved. Yule alumenesis, the one who filled we are the men. Kwa kutaka kutangulizwa tu. We want kutangulizwa tu kutangulizwa. Put in the forefront. Asiye taka kuambiwa umekosa pale. Put it want to be rectified here and there. I need very true. Kumbe so Roho haridhiki the spirit was contented Nikawa ni kweli and it was very true Wasehemu nafanya hizo kazi kweli to a portion I was doing that work Lakini natamani niambiwe amefanya pale But I decided to be told he has done Na this Na kinyume kabisa and it was totally contrary Hallelujah Hallelujah Nikasema asante I said thank you Toka siku hiyo nikaokoka From that day I was saved Yule mchonyi yule The chonyi man in me akatoka got out Waka leo atoke. Even to that let him go in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yule wanaume ni sisi. Feeling we are the men. Milima hiyo. Those hills. Kabomolewa na Bwana Yesu. Were broken down by the Lord Jesus. Kwa maonyo mengi ya mtumishi wa Mungu mchungaji. Through the warnings from the past of the Lord mchungaji. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wengi walimwogopa. Many feared him. Unapitana kando. They walk by and pass by Lakele a sign. But Lord enable when I discern that. Ukali wake kwangu. So his standards to me. Maonyo yake maonyo yake mengi kwangu. And so many warnings to me. Nikunipenda sikunikasi. To love me not hurting me. Sikutonipenda nikunipenda. Not hurting me but loving me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Na yeye kweli kutoka siku hiyo. And truly from that day. See? He went silent. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Nilipojaliwa kule moyoni toba. I was never the repentance in my heart. Mungu akaniokoa. God save me. Leo mimi ya milima hiyo. Today those hills. Naomba izidi kuyeyuka. I pray they continue melting down. Ndio Yesu anaweza kubadilisha mtu. Sasa Jesus can change one. Lakini je wewe wataka? But do you will. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wataka? Do you will. Wataka enaji. Whosoever will set him come. Kuna dhambi bwana Yesu hawezi kuponya. There's no sin Jesus can't heal. Tusome Warumi 2:9. Read for us Romans 2:9. Ndio anasema dhiki na shida. That says tribulation and anguish. Juu yao watendao. Upon them who commit evil. Lakini but 
Baraka amani na furaha. But blessings peace and joy. Watendao mema heshima. To those who do good honor. Usibadhaike maana una mabaya. Don't be dismayed because you are Kujaliwa toba. Once enable the repentance. Anasema Mungu hana upendeleo. He says God is no respect of persons. Soma 9:11. Diki na shida juu ya kila nafsi ya mwanadamu atendaye uovu. Mwaudi kwanza na muyunani pia. Bali utukufu na heshima na amani kwa kila mtu atendaye mema. Mwaudi kwanza na muyunani pia. Endelea. Kwa maana hakuna upendeleo kwa Mungu. Bas. Tribulation and anguish upon every soul of man that doeth evil of the Jew first and also of the Gentile. But glory, honor, and praise to every man that worketh good to the Jew first and also to the Gentile. For there is no respect of persons with God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Diki na shida. Tribulation and anguish. Diya kila nafsi ya munadamu ya tendaye uovu. Upon every woman's soul that committed evil. Yunani kwanza na muya utipi. The Jew and the Gentile first. Kini utukufu na ishima na amani. But glory and honor and praise. Kila tendaye mema. To soever does good. Hayo Mungu hana upendeleo. So God is not respect of persons. Hata kama unajiki gani? Even if you have a tribulation with you. Lakini ujaliwe toba ya kumrudia Mungu. You never repent us to return to God. Ukijua uwezaye kukuokoa ni Mungu. Knowing they want to save his God. Katika Bwana wetu Yesu Kristo. In our Lord Jesus Christ. Yeye ndiye alifuta hati ya hatia ya dhambi. He's the one who rest the unrighteous for and ordinance. Ndio alishitaka na kunishtaki mbele za Mungu. Was written to accuse us before God. Na waamini yeye ndiye aweze kunigeuza. Then you believe they want to change you. Na ujaliwe kutaka kule moyoni and be able to will in your heart kule moyoni and believe in your heart kupenda kule moyoni loving in your heart na ujue siwezi mwenyewe and knowing i'm not able my own kuniokoa ni bwana yesu whoever can save me is the lord yes. then you go unto him ulaumu mtu kule you don't blame anyone in your heart ugeuze kwa hili change me from this ugeuze kwa hili change me from this hallelujah hallelujah na wahubiri wako the preachers are there mimi nataka niokolewe na hili i want to be saved from this pray for me God changes one. Because he has the power of the Lord Jesus. As I say, you are not able to do anything without me. We are not able without the Lord Jesus. Whatever human being does, don't be given a gift to do anything say, without me nothing will happen. One strengthening you is God. Even the one you see today, God will strengthen him today. When he enables you to do good, it's God not through your understanding, not through your knowledge, not through your skills, it is the masses of God. Hallelujah. We had a brother. Anafanya kazi huko Uingereza huko. He's working in overseas. Anasema huko mtu mweusi uongoze watu wengi. He's saying a black person to lead the whites here. Anasema ni mimi mweusi. He's saying I'm black. Na watu wa kule wana elimu kubwa kubwa. And they are so educated there. Imetoka vyuo vile vya duniani. Oxford International Universities are there. Na mimi hata sikufika huko. And I never go there. Lakini kwa maombi. But by the prayers ya watu wa Mungu hapa of the men of God here. Alikuja hapa hana mbele wala nyuma. He came a destitute. Wakati bomba kubwa ile la mfereji linachimbwa hii wa maji. At a time we are bringing and channeling the water here. Anasema alikuwa nikalala hapa. He said I used to sleep here. Basi hata ukiangalia hivi hakuna. So wakati mfereji unachimbwa huko. At that time you are channeling the water here. Jimbe wa Bwana akiwa amepewa na missionary kuongoza. The message of the Lord was given to lay. Kalalani huko. From Kalalani. Kwa watu wengi. There were so many. Lakini anasema nilikuwa hapa hapa. But he said I was among them. So then later on I went to him, uncle to England. So I was not educated highly. But the work I do today, I'm leading the whites in their homes. They are very impossible there, but I had God has given me the knowledge to work as a And know that I went to the high It's God who has enabled me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's God. 
Wafanya kutuwa nguvu na mungu. We are being strengthened by God. So don't say I'm not able to do it. One who saves us the Lord Jesus. Even if you have gone to sin. God is waiting for you to have the repentance to return unto him. Honor is there. Peace is there. To so ever changes and does good. Don't say. I don't know. Anger is defeated. Bitter is defeated. We are not able on our own. Whoever saves the Lord Jesus. But now, do you will? You feel I won't be able to live with this neighbor and this husband and this wife. You feel it's the cause of your bitterness. This husband is the cause. Okay. You don't say I live with this thing because of somebody. Jesus said seek to follow peace with all. All people. Even those who offend seek to have peace with them. What gets inside doesn't Define it. He has spoken evil to you. He has insulted. That's not your sin. But peace to come out of you. And pardoning to come out of you. You are called the child of God. Hallelujah. His insults and his despise. That's not your sin. But what comes out of you? As I threw the teachings, I saw the late servant of God. I decided he's a man of lies. I've never seen him offending anyone. He doesn't glorify himself. Hallelujah. That's why I call him this peace you have. He told me, go back to your father. Hallelujah. Go back to your father and your mother. You can't be a child of peace here. If you are never a child of peace from your home, you are fighting. Whom will you love then? I said it's very true. He said go pray to God to enable you. Peace right from home. Okay. I call him and ask him here. I see you not troubling anyone. You don't seek for great things. You don't offend people. Amen. Amen. Some are harassing you. Is the food ready? You say it's ready. You don't feel like you're despised as a man. I told him now I'm not able. Want to hold a waste for me? Did you call me to work here? I'm not able to do that. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It depends on how you grew up. So, we are not able to create ourselves. Read for us. Whichever failure you have or tribulation, Jesus came. There's no respect to persons. Hiki na shida juu ya kila nafsi ya mwanadamu atendai ovu. Muyahudi kwanza na muyui nani pia. Bali utukufu na heshima na amani kwa kila mtu atendai mema. Muyahudi kwanza na muyui nani pia. Kwa maana hakuna upendeleo kwa Mungu. Tribulation and anguish upon every soul of man that doeth evil of the Jew first and also of the Gentile. But glory, honor, and peace to every man that worketh good, to the Jew first and also to the Gentile. For there is no respect of persons with God. Because Jesus came to save the sinners, not the righteous. So whenever you say these sinners have come me, or maybe bitterness has come me, how? We can't overcome it ourselves. That was saved. He never saved the same. What God is looking at, do you will? Do you will? One went to the Lord Jesus. He said, if you will, cleanse me. Lord, if you will, cleanse me. If you, I will. When you read the Bible, it says, when I will, 
I will be clear. What brought me from heaven under the sun? Those who will. Those who will. It is those who will. He came to save his people from their sins. Those who believe in him. That is able. That's the Bible says you will be cut a child and call him Jesus because he saved his people from their sins. That's why normally he said there are those of Jesus and those who are not his. He will save his people from their sins. We have his people and those who are not his. Who are his and who are not his. Are oh, ah, those who believe in him. Those are his. Are those who don't believe. Have not become his because they've not will. But those who say, I'm here, my sinner, just save me. I will. One said, I'm here. I'm on the cross due to my sins. You are innocent. When you go to paradise, then remember me. He said, whenever you go, today we'll be together in paradise. He was one of Jesus on the cross because he believed. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. One refused. He never agreed to be one of Jesus. You save the servant. Save yourself and save us too. He seeing him not not able. He seem not able. He performed the sign. Why is he not performing the sign? Let him save himself and save us too. He wasn't of Jesus. But one said, you, why do you insult even God? We are here due to our sins. That one is very innocent. Fine, you are in tribulation. You are in a problem. But you still see, Jesus has the power to save you. You believe in him together the problem. You are on the cross today. In evil. In shortages. In bankruptcy. But you know I'm bankrupt. But Jesus has power to save me. But you say now, all my giving and offering, my works are spoiled. Where is God now? You being bankrupt. Or maybe things are difficult. Or maybe there's misery. It doesn't mean Jesus doesn't have the power to save. On the cross, you see Jesus is saving. You tell him Jesus saved me. I know this has come upon me. It is upon my sins. You don't blame anybody. You don't feel one is the cause of you getting to those millions. Don't blame the wife or the husband. You don't say there's a wizard who blames me. Or maybe in a company there's one who is not feeling good of me. You know all these objections. I am a sinner. Jesus saved me. You haven't seen your sin. But you know I'm a sinner. Dying from your heart to believe that. You. Then you tell him, save me, Lord. He'll save you. He'll surely save you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because you are his and you believe in him. Being on the cross, whenever you are in tribulation or together with Jesus, you are together with him on the same cross. But you still see him to be the same. My problem here is nothing to the Lord Jesus. It hasn't gone away because of my sins. God to see you agreeing it is your sins. God save me. Jesus will save you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Surely. Because what brought him under the sun is to save people from the sin. To see you're not blaming anybody. You know I'm on the cross. It is due to my transgressions. Jesus saved me and forgave me. Seek for the preacher and the church. And you don't blame anybody. Luke 15 from 17 when you go to a point of eating husks he decided eating with the swines hallelujah he looked around 
Hata hivi nimefikia kutamani kula pamoja na nguruwe. I've got to a point of eating together with the salt. Mikate iliyooza iliyotupa kwa mapipa huko inaokotwa na makabeji yaliyooza. All the rotting cabbages and nyama zilizo watu wamekula wamechoka nazo wametupa kwa all the meat dumped. Wana nguruwe wale vitu visafi. Because the swans normally don't eat good food. Akajikuta hata amefikia kutamani kula hivyo sasa. He got to a point of deciding to eat. Na pangusa michanga mikate ilio pa kwa blue band ana. He dust off and ate. Mungu akamjalia toba. God enabled me the repentance. Hakula mumutu yeye. He never blamed anyone. Ndiye sababu. Is the cause. Mungu akamwona moyoni amezingatia. God saw him decreeing in his heart. Asema mimi. He said I. Ni watumishi wangapi wa baba yangu? How many of my father's servants? Wanakula na kusaza. Are eating to spare. Na mimi hapa nafa na njaa. And I am going without food. Hata nimefikia kutamani kula pamoja na nguruwe. I go to eating with the swines. Ah mimi nimekosa mbele no, za Mungu. I have transgressed before. Na mbele za baba yangu. And before my father. Moyoni akazingatia. He considered his heart. Akajali watoba nitaondoka. He was never the repentance and leave. Nitaondoka mimi. And leave. Niende kwa baba yangu. And go to my father. Nimwambie nimekosa mbele za Mungu. And tell him I've transgressed before. For you and God. I don't deserve to be called your child. I'm ready to stay here. And be a servant. servant like the rest. Oh. Okay. Jesus says I never care for the righteous. I care for the transgressors who, who repent. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Akaondoka. Hile. Mungu akuone kule moyoni umeamua kuondoka kwa hali yako. Departing. Umetaka kutoka katika mabaya. You will to get out of evil. Moyoni umetamani kuolewa na ubaya. You decide to be safe from evil. Umezongwa na anasa zinao, levi, lakini akuona umetaka. To see you willing in your heart. Nitaishi hali hii paka lini. For how long will I be in this manner? Nimechoka. I'm tired. Akuone kule moyoni umekubali kuondoa katika mabaya umezingatia you've considered haleluya haleluya Yesu atakulaki Jesus will come and embrace you Mana uwezo anao yeye kugeuza because he has the power to change uwezo anao kuondolea kile kiu he has the power to take out the last of you out of you lakini watu hata wakasema but even if people say wewe umekosa hili kwa nini you've gone wrong this way why and why are you evil hata wakuwekee kamati. And even sit down as a committee. Wewe unasema sio wewe uliingia pale. You say I don't know the one who was there. Hata fulani ni Saidi alikuona. In fact one saw him. That is it is very true. Hata fulani aliniona eh. One saw me yes. Basi kuitikia huko si. So that response is not repentance. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Kwa vile umeambiwa hata fulani alikuona. Because you are told so and so so. Basi kama ni hivyo ni kweli. That's why say it's very true. Leo jingine mimi niliingia. Okay, I truly go to that house. Mana watu wamesema hata fulani alikuona Johanna alikuona ni shahidi so 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 Ndio basi nimekubali. Doesn't say I've agreed. Ah Yesu hawezi kuja hapa. Jesus can't come in such a place. Amen. Amen. Lakini huyu akasema But this one said nitaondoka mimi. I leave. Akajaliwa kuzingatia. He was enabled to consume. Somee kuanzia 17. We'll first from 17. Aliposingatia moyoni mwake alisema Ni watumishi wangapi wa baba yangu wanaokula chakula na kusaza na mimi hapa ninakufa kwa njaa nitaondoka nitakwenda kwa baba yangu na kumwambia baba nimekosa juu ya mbingu na mbele zako Sistahili kuitwa mwana wako tena nifanye kama mmoja wa watumishi wako Akaondoka akaenda kwa babaye alipokuwa angali mbali Baba yake alimuona, akamuonea huruma, akaenda mbio akamwangukia shingoni, akambusu sana. Bas wacha. And when he came to himself, he said, how many hired servants of my father's have bread enough and to spare, and I perish with hunger. I will arise and go to my father, and I will say unto him, Father, I have sinned against heaven and before thee, and I'm no more worthy to be called thy son. Make me as one of thy hired servants. And he arose and came to his father. But when he was yet a great way off, his father saw him in hard compassion and ran and fell on his neck and kissed him. Baba ndi anaondoka na mkimbilia. Is the father running towards him? Bona mimi na wewe tusilakiwe na Mungu. You and I na need to be embraced by God to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hata baba hajajua huyu mwana anakuja. The father hasn't not known the situation. Bado anakuja haja, haja, haja sema baba 
is on the way coming not Lakini, yet apologized kule moyoni, but in his heart ame, he has decided to change he has agreed he is a transgressor. He is ready to change. He is ready whichever condemnation. He has done it right for me to dwell in the condemnation. He is ready not to be called a child. And stay in the servant's quarters. And eat to the servants. Showing he has agreed he is a transgressor. Down in his heart. He doesn't blame anybody. It says the father, when he saw him from far, now that he has been enabled and repented, the father ran to him and embraced him. Before he said, I'm sorry, why this person, every Sunday, the same is the same, and is not embraced to go there. Is there repentance to agree to change? This one hasn't apologized. Amen. Amen. Baba the father mpere. has run to him and embraced him. Hata yuko kifuani, he's on the chest. Hata na agizo, Baba fact, he's commanding. Fact, that's when the time is apologizing. He's, apologize. he's on, on the chest of the father. Okay, I'm sorry before you. Hata baba the father doesn't listen to that. Because from the bush, he was unable to repent us to return to God. I to go to my father and tell him I've transgressed. Ndio watu wa Mungu wakajali watoba hiyo kila mmoja should one be enabled to repent nzima, the whole world Makanisani humo in churches here Mungu hayuko mbali God is not far Mema hayako mbali Good things are not far Uzima hauko mbali Life is not far Amani hayako mbali Peace nakisi. is not far Iko hapo hapa karibu It's right here next to you Hallelujah Hallelujah Haiko mbali It's not far Baraka ziko mbali Blessings are not far Hata hujafanya You haven't done anything Lakini hakuona una toba ya kutaka kufanya To see the repentance to do He'll make a way here and this and this. But in your heart you ask, where does it go? I give people that I don't know. People whom they want. Like the one we read yesterday. Okay, this is your pound. I saw you are harvesting a place you never planted. Take your pound here. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What? At least I get some ah, savings. Take your pound. I've seen your work waiting for people to bring for you. Okay. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Because you don't have the repentance. He was told bring. It was added to one with ten. They said that and had Ten of them. Why are you adding him more? He told them one with something will be added more. And one without will be denied whatever he has. Those who don't want to be ruled, bring them to me. I slay them. Salvation is there. Jesus said, You never the repentance in your heart. One who says the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. One who pleases the Lord Jesus. That's why this one considered in the bush there was no preacher. There was no preacher in the bush. But he was enabled the repentance. He is coming to the preacher. Hallelujah. But he already has been forgiven because he is ready to change from the heart. But some come, but in the heart, they have not been enabled to the repentance. That's why whenever you preach there, the same people coming for counseling. First of all, when he sees a strange preacher, that's why he says, he saw this one who will save me. That's why he got one in VOK. He says, you Rimba, I've never had a preacher like you. Today you've come to save me. The servant of God, my God, God, let him be blessed oh. for sending you. Ah, yeah. Okay. Leo, Today, you preach the truth to me. I ask God that you may continue preaching here. I knew very early. When I look around, preachers who preached to me went there. You do have the counseling, he'll call you close. Who are diligent truly. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So I thought, 
Huyu yani haya maneno ni mara ya kwanza kuhubiriwa. So, is the first time for him to hear this one. Sawa ndugu. I told him okay brother. Ela maneno haya kwani tangu uokolewe. From the time ngama akasema. Ah, you have enjoyed your conference. The way you preach today. Hata si bila nimesikia. It's not how I normally hear. Haya enda mwambie Mungu ni sana. Okay go and tell God forgive you. I came and stayed for two, three months. I was taken back to the same place. The same person after preaching, he came. He says, you today, in fact, you are the last. Thank you, God of missionary, for sending you. The same he has forgotten. Exactly what he spoke earlier. I was sorry to him and said truly. This one hasn't been enabled repentance. I was sorry to him. Truly it's God to enable you the repentance. I was sorry to him. And he had a tribulation with him. I was so sorry to him, God to help him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Truly. So let's pray to God. The Lord to enable the young and the elder in church. A spirit of repentance. Go to enable people. To enable the young and the elderly. Our youth, boys and girls, the repentance. There's nothing impossible. They are here emulating evil. And God will bring them back. When we wish them and be sent back to God. God to enable them, the repentance to come back to God. Like this one here. He has truly rebelled to the father and the mother. But he decided to come back. Why am I eating hands? Why should I commit evil? Why should I eat with the swine? Go to see if works are the present. And feel God can take away the problems. And feel their rebellions. And be enabled that repentance. And be enabled that repentance. And they should be enabled to enable, get to this way and come back to Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The works are there. Good things are there. Businesses are there. God will save them. Let them be enabled to repent. So whenever you go for prayers, prayer requests are here. Some are there. They brought their cries. We pray for them, they are friends. God of the founder can save them. They brought the prayer request knowing their brethren here. God will give them according to their faith. According to their faith. Hallelujah. We pray to God to fulfill for them their hard desire. And again the Lord who started peace to accomplish the same things. The way God has started peace in our elections thank him believing the Lord has fulfilled. Even whenever it will be announced peace is present. Hallelujah. We tell the Lord thank you for the peace. Amen. Amen. And again, we don't forsake this prayer. It's bringing a lot of benefits. Kenya, Uganda, Tanzania, and Kila Mahali. Kenya, Uganda, Tanzania, all over. Katika kanisa lake Mungu. In the church of God. Bana tuokuwe na kila neno soro la kufa. The Lord to save us from all not worthy. Kila neno soro la kufa. All not good. Kila neno soro la kufa. All not good. Bana tuokuwe na. The Lord to save us from it. Bana tuokuwe na. The Lord to save us from it. Kila neno soro la kufa. All not good. Katika kanisa la Mungu. In the church of God. Na katika taifa zote duniani. In all the nations on earth. All not good. The Lord to save us from it. God of the founder to save us from it. God of the founder mother to save us from it. All not good. In our midst. Kenya, Uganda, Tanzania. Congo and the whole world. All not good. In the midst of human beings. The Lord our God. Abraham and Jacob. To save us. To heal us.
Na Mungu awajalie watu wake kanisa. ya kumrudia. They repent us to return. Kama mwana yule mpotevu. Like the prodigal son. Wajaliwe kuzingatia. They enable to consider. Awajalie toba kila wakubwa kwa wao. They repent us to them. Watoto wetu wasichana kwa wavulana. Our boys and girls. Waandiko kwa wadada. All the brothers and sisters. Wahubiri. Preachers. Kila mahali. Everywhere. Tujaliwe toba ya kumrudia. Let's be enable the repent us to return. Toba. The repentance. Haleluya. Haleluya. Mungu wa mwanzilishi God of the founder yeye ni Mungu wa kazi the God of works na atafanya he'll make it happen mema katikati yetu good in our midst ndugu Hamilton Mwanyalo our brother Hamilton Mwanyalo we Mungu amtimizie jaza moyo we pray for him God to fulfill his desires Mungu amtimizie God to fulfill for him jaza moyo wake his hard desires katika haja hizo in all the requests kila uzito ulioko the difficulty that is in He has requested for prayers. The Lord to fulfill for him. Wake, his hard her desires. Amokoe, and save him. Na kila vizuzu ya mema from anjiaza. all the hindrances. Amtimizie aje za moyo wake and fulfill his hard desires. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Na kila ndugu na dada and every brother and sister. Wale hapa na walio nje. Those who are here and those who are outside. Bwana watimizie aje za moyo wake. The Lord to fulfill their hard desires. Wewe na wewe unalako. You to your own. Tia hapo ndani. Including the prayer. Mungu wetu our god mimi naona ishara nyingine kubwa i see a very great sign hallelujah hallelujah i on i see it hallelujah hallelujah ya kuokolewa mahali being saved in an area kwa kufanana kama wokovu hauko it sounded like there's no salvation you know no but i see salvation amen amen wajua you know Yesu alisema Jesus say duniani iko dhiki lakini jikoni moyo the stimulation but encourage yourself because I've overcome the world na kuna kitu cha kuja kuwa maisha ni mwako something that can come and like, and and sound never go lakini ukajaliwa kusimama imara should be able to be found kumngoja yeye and wait for him kumngoja yeye and wait for him bila inasema the bible says kumngoja yao bwana wait for the lord watapata nguvu mpya will get your strength hallelujah hallelujah watapata nini they'll get new strength so let's kneel down and thank god and pray to him
Amen. Amen. I ask you to stand up. We believe our God, the founder, has fulfilled all the requests we've done. Because he said, you ask, shall be given. No, it shall be opened for you. And seek, you shall find. We believe he has heard. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I ask you to close our eyes. One sister to close the service with a word of prayer. Bana una msiki ya bana, tusaidie bana, tusaidie kutunza kupokea bana, ili jina lako mokozi, likaweza kutukuza bana katika maisha yetu baba. Sante unaweza mungu wa manzilichi, hakuna kama wewe bwana kwa kiasifa na utukufu. Sante bwana kwa kazi njema ile umeanza bwana ya mali katika nchi yetu, kwa maombi bwana ya mtumishi wako, una msiki ya bana mtumishi wako mte ule ule mchagu wa mwenyewe baba. Sante, mana tumeona mkono wako, tumeona amani baba, hivo tunamini, utatimiliza mungu wa mazilishi, baka mwicho baba, kwa jili ya utukufu wako mungu wa mama mazilishi buwana. Sante kwa rehema zako, tufumwe kwa amani baba, nyuma ya mazilishi wako buwana, endelea kutuliza meo yao, kwa jili ya utukufu wako buwana, timishi wako buwana, endelea buwana kumjaza, kwa jili buwana, ya utukufu wako buwana, sisi kandisa, tufumwe kwa amani buwana, tuendele buwana, kutunza zile talanta baba, kuzalisha buwana, kwa watu buwana, kwa wambao tunaweza kuzaha matunda baba, tuwe matawi, ya naweza kuzaha buwana. Sante kwa uruma zako, tuna kuhinua kwa jili ya mtumishu wako, unampaneno la uzima kwa jili ya maisha yetu na watoto wetu. Sante bana kwa uruma zako, jina lako linuliwe litukuzwe bana. Sante kutenda, sante utatumuma kwa mani kwa jili ya utukuwa jina lako na ni kwa jina lako mkozi wetu. Amen. 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 Mungu wetu wa mwama mwanzilishi ya tubariki sana sana. Amen.